Brothers and sisters, we stand at the precipice of a defining struggle. Brace yourself for the time has come to rise and demand justice for your kid and kin. Today, many homes are in despair. Many lives have been shattered by government's continuous theft of our savings. We give them power, they abuse it. We give them our taxes, they misuse it. Honest advice, they refuse it. And today, they are taking our savings. In these difficult times where many have lost their jobs and depend on their investments to sustain their dignity, feed and shelter their children, pay fees, buy medication for themselves, parents and dependents. Why would a government we trust with our hard-earned savings is so insensitive? Enough is enough. With unwavering conviction, we summon all individual bondholders sympathizers, dependents, and every soul yearning for a voice. Together we shall occupy the Ministry of Finance starting Tuesday, 11 July 2023 at 7 a.m. In unity, we shall demand justice and the immediate payment of all outstanding principal and coupon payments, some of which have been delayed for over 130 days. We shall insist upon the swift and resolute implementation of the agreement enshrined in the MOU of 16th May 2023. Our government must be honorable and honor its word. People of Ghana, we shall not be silenced. We shall rise as a tidal wave of resilience and determination, picketing till they resolve our grievances. Let this rallying cry resonate throughout the land, echoing the hearts of every Ghanaian who yearns for a better tomorrow. Rise up, join us, and fight for yourself and the future of God. Do not expect someone else to fight for you. If everyone expects someone to fight for them, no one will fight. An oppression shall prevail so i call on you today stand up and be counted be a citizen and not a spectator god bless our homeland ghana